Yep. All right, so I'm just going to show you guys how to set up the pre-oxygenation mask we're going to use for COVID patients. So Lisa is going to be our COVID patient for today. And this is really only going to be for people that are going to need pre-oxygenation before intubation. This is not your normal like BiPAP, CPAP, and any of those patients. We do have the viral filters, so just use those separately. This is only for pre-oxygenating before you intubate. And essentially, it's going to be a closed circuit, so you don't get exposed to any of the virus particles. So you're going to have a bag, which I've made up five so far, full of this stuff. All right, um, it has all of your regular intubation equipment, and the stuff that's different is that it's going to come with a BiPAP mask that's already going to have a viral filter attached to it, and this is the first thing you're going to put on. The patient will still be able to breathe, but it's going to filter all the particulates through here, and it's a HEPA filter, so it filters out 99.9% .9 out of all the stuff. So we're going to put this on first, so we're going to be patient. Good patient, so she's gonna help you put it on. And you can breathe pretty well right now, right? So, just drop this down quick. Right, it'll feel a little more uncomfortable once we put the peak valve on and start giving her. But right now, everything she breathes in and out is already filtered, so she's pretty safe. All right, the next thing we're gonna put on is comes in these little biohazard bags. This is a little tube connector. This is gonna help you connect the BBM to it. So it only goes in one way, and you'll notice it goes in this way. And there's a little side port here that we're going to hook up oxygen to. So it comes with some oxygen tubing, and I suggest hooking this up to just a regular oxygen tank. And we're going to crank it all the way up, doesn't matter, and this is already going to start giving her some oxygen when she breathes in. And the most important part is going to be the BVM, which I already attached to peak valve. They'll all have a peak valve already attached to, which you can set to whatever you want. They're all be set automatically to five, but you can go up and down as you need. You're going to also attach this to oxygen. Crank this all the way up. And this just goes on the bottom. And you're all set. How do you feel? So if the patient's already breathing, they'll be able to breathe in and out normally, and you'll feel the peak, right? You feel the peak, and you have to breathe out against resistance. Right? So people, this will pre-oxygenate them, even if they're still breathing. And if they get sedated or they go apneic, you can still bag them. And it's a closed circuit. Everything's being filtered. So that's how you set it up.